Good morning, beautiful people. Today we will be leaving uh, Banos, and this uh, is our amazing breakfast. Uh, we have to wake up really early because today we have more than seven hours driving with the motorcycle. Yes. <laughs> and here we have all fresh bread. Fresh bread. Uh, I have uh, oh, fruit salad, special fruit honey, yogurt, cereals. Cheese, butter, jam. And here I have uh, huevos rancheros, uh, that is eggs uh, with uh, um, beans, uh, nachos with guacamole, a little bit of tomato. Here we have uh, cheese, uh, some sauce. Buon provecho, con appetit. Good morning, everyone. We are ready to start a new adventure today from Baños to Chukchilan, close to Kilotoa Crater Lake. Bye bye, baños. The road uh, we got uh, just uh, get, getting out uh, of Baños, uh, Ruta Ecologica. It's amazing, it's beautiful. You can see all Baños, the waterfall, the volcano just there in front. Uh, and uh, wow, the river, yeah, you can see the, the waterfall. It looks so small from here. Beautiful farms, cattle farm. This is the view from the top. Baños, the volcano in Garagua. Wow. Luca. Luca, the motorcycle. The antennas. Sarita. The road is all rocks here. Okay, we are gaining altitude. Uh, it's getting colder, so Sara is putting one more uh, 
a layer of weather. Uh, a layer more. We, we are changing our gloves. Uh, these are the ones when it's hot. We are getting the, the bigger ones now. And uh, yeah, we will reach uh, for over 4,000 meters. So now we are 3,500 meters altitude. Yeah. Whew. Big gloves. Uh. We arrive at the Kilotoa Crater Lake. Wow! Wow! Incredible. Let's make a drone footage. <laughs> yeah. This is Kilatoa Crater Lake. Uh, yes, <laughs> this is a two miles wide water-filled caldera, and this is the most western volcano in the Equatorian Andes. The caldera was formed about 800 years ago by the collapse of the volcano following a catastrophic eruption. The greenish blue color of the water is given by minerals that are dissolved in the water. We have seen some similar colors in uh, Guatemala and Central America as well. In Salvador, Volcano Santa Ana. Watch the video if you want to see another beautiful caldera. Let's enjoy this view, guys. And then we will head to our last hotel for this adventure. Uh, we need to eat some feel warm, I think, because it's pretty cold today. Tomorrow will be our last day of yeah. this amazing adventure with uh, Ecuador uh, Freedom Bikes Rental and our Yamaha Tenere 660 that brought us all around Ecuador. We have, we have seen places that we never imagined we would be able to see and the motorcycle gave us the freedom to explore and to go off-road even in um, in road that we cannot really small roads really small off-road cobblestone roads uh, we passed through several villages in the andes 4000 meters altitude really off the beaten path yeah absolutely It's really foggy, here the weather changed so fast. Yeah, you cannot see anything. It was all clean and now it's foggy. And, and then you just drive and look. There are things like this in the middle of the road. Not mark. What? <laughs> are you kidding me? You can die. Where's the road? <laughs> <laughs>
Where's the road, guys? Where's the road? <laughs> no road. No road. arrived at Mama Hilda Hotel and now we will show you around. Turning on some fire here. Um, warm up. Uh, so, so we can warm up all our room. Yeah, my place will be just next to the fire. To the fire because I'm freezing, guys. <laughs> For dinner. <laughs> Not going too far. How cool is our cottage there, Sana? It's beautiful, I like it, and especially with the fire that now it's all warm and nice inside. I can edit all the videos. I'm starving. It's the restaurant. Some hot soup, delicious hot Potato. soup. Potato. Good morning, beautiful people. Good morning. Today is our last day with uh, Ecuador Freedom Bike Rental. Ah, we'll go back to La Quilio. We miss La Quilio. Yeah, today we're driving back to Quito and uh, we had so much fun. Uh, this adventure was uh, extremely different uh, because uh, we were driving with a motorcycle that is faster, it's lighter, you can go everywhere, off-road, on-road, in little places where we don't fit with Lucky Liu. Yes. And so much cheaper on fuel. We went to the coast and then we went to Chimborazo Volcano that is one of the highest volcanoes in the world. We, ha we have seen lagoons, we have seen villages we drove on the beach we drove on the mountains uh, we drove uh, in the many different landscapes uh. of course there are some 
cons and pros when you are riding with a motorcycle. You are lighter, you feel more free to go wherever you want and to stop wherever you want. But mm. if it's raining or if it's cold or if it's hot, uh, you are just there, outside. And you need to go. You cannot say, okay, I will wait. You need to go and you will take all the rain. If it's pouring down rain, you will take everything. If it's freezing cold, yeah, and at the at the end of the day, you will feel it. You are just destroyed. If we finish, we end it every day destroyed, like we have done a marathon. But it's totally worth it, guys. Uh, if uh, you have this dream, like I always had, uh, of uh, having an adventure, traveling with a motorcycle, yeah. and uh, you are probably in... Uh, uh, Europe or you are in North America and Canada United States uh, uh, it's so much easier to rent a bike here in uh, South America in Ecuador yeah. than uh, bring it and do all the papers uh, insurance uh, make all the borders the tour that we have done is called CCC tour cloud forest coast and craters because you you have the possibility to see everything and it's so well organized you have all the itinerary well done, uh, you just put the navigator and you follow the navigator every day you will stop in amazing boutique hotel, refugee, really nice with hot shower, breakfast included, it's really uh, well done. Every night uh, your hotel is already booked, uh, mm -hmm. you only have to read uh, your road book uh, and follow the GPS, uh, everything is on there, you can choose between uh, paved road, uh, off-road uh, and uh, many different uh, things uh, all on your GPS uh, they will teach you how to use it before starting all this adventure and, and it's amazing on the road we have uh, different highlights to stop and to see so it uh, your day will never be boring in seven days you will discover a part of Ecuador that it's not so obvious thank you so much uh, to Kurt and to Sylvain for this amazing experience uh, we really recommend this to everyone that comes to Ecuador. That and guys, uh, check the link in the description because there is uh, so many tours and so many yeah. packages you can choose. Uh, uh, 10 days, 15 days, 7 days, 4 days, uh, one, one day. day. There is so many. You can make uh, a package just for you. And uh, it's, uh, it's amazing. They know all the country. They have people all over. So if something happens, uh, they will give you a phone and you can call them and they will rescue in, uh, in any way. And, and, uh, and Kurt is from Boston, United States. Sylvain is from France. So they speak fluently French, English, Spanish as well. So you will really feel comfortable. Yes. You don't have any problems. So. Guys, we need to go on the road now because it's already late. We have to drive seven hours today. Yeah. Back to Quito. See Ciao. you there. Beautiful people, we are back in Lucky Liu. We are back home. We are super happy to be here. The adventure with the motorcycle was amazing, but now we need to think about Lucky Liu. We need to fix our truck to be able to continue our amazing expedition down to Argentina. As you can see, we are putting everything back. It's quite a mess. I'm preparing a salad. Luca is responding to your comments. Guys, I'm trying to <laughs> get into all your comments, but we have been uh, one week, uh, uh, more, 10 days uh, traveling with the motorcycle. I haven't yeah. been able to answer to your comments. Uh, so now I'm getting crazy. It's like 
400 comments uh, to answer, but uh, I'm getting there. Yeah, you will. We'll catch you tomorrow. Uh, other mechanic works. We love you so much. Thank you for all your comments, for your support. We hope that you enjoy this amazing adventure across Ecuador. We love you guys. If you like the video, please give us a thumbs up. Uh, subscribe to our channel because we will be doing some amazing, crazy, unbelievable stuff. Uh, so stay tuned. Ciao guys. Love you. Have a good night. And consider to subscribe to our channel if you haven't done already and hit the bell to get the notification every time we post a new amazing video. <laughs> Buonanotte! Ciao! From Lucky Liu, the beast.